Hello everyone. Um, I would like to thank Karen Zhu for acknowledging what is happening in Iran these days because that is personally affecting me as well. Um, my name is Hanya Barzagari um, and I am your city council candidate with Vision Vancouver. Like so many other Vancouverites, I was not born and raised here, but I'm so proud to call it my home. I am an immigrant, a proud Canadian, a medical doctor by training, and in the last four years, I've been working for a health technology company. There are different reasons I'm working for city council. Uh, when I used to practice medicine in Iran, I worked with so many uh, equity-deserving groups, as well as when I used to volunteer at Mount St. Joseph Hospital and paying the sick care. And I would love to bring that equity lens if I hopefully get elected. Since I'm a medical doctor in background, I used to work with so many mental health patients, drug users, and their families, and we keep saying that we have mental health crisis in our city. And I hope if I get elected, I can bring the experience I have. Health is a provincial matter, however, there are things that we can do at city level. We can focus more on care coordination and education, collaborate with Vancouver Coastal Health and province to make sure that we can get things done. The other reason I'm running is I'm a renter myself and I believe everybody deserves a, an affordable, secure, and dignified place to call home. It should be dignified. Um, and it is something that I'm going to work on with my wonderful team, uh, my co-candidates at Vision Vancouver. Since I'm working in a, at, a tech, at a health technology company, I would like to support our city to work for more opportunities in business, as an example, technology growth to keep our young professional professionals here rather than losing them to East of Canada or to US. And at last but not least, I would like to focus on inclusion and belonging, not just for immigrants, for LGBTQIA2+, seniors, people with any kind of disabilities, indigenous people who are generously sharing this land with us. Thank you so much.